people want to make their own way in life. They don't want to be dependent on aid. That's, um, it's too threatening, actually. If, if you haven't got a way to you know, support yourself, life is a very uncertain thing. There certainly is uh, bad aid. I mean, there's aid that just goes in and gets paid to a whole load of consultants from the country that's concerned. Um, so the money just flows straight back out. Um, no jobs are created. Expats are brought in, whatever. There's you know, aid going in without the proper controls on so that it does get into you know, people's hands in a, in, a, in a corrupt way and is misspent on you know, big white elements. There's plenty of bad aid. But I think over the years, we've learned quite a lot about what good aid is. But also, we've learned that you've got to get the people of the country themselves really holding their own governments to account for the way aid is spent. And if that means the budget on the school door, so that that local village can see what aid ought to be coming, what, what budget, not aid, but what budget should be coming from their government, so they can demand that. That's the sort of situation that we want. So governments are really held to account by their own people.